It's how we show our Susie love. It's on, right? It's queer as fuck. Did you hear that? I think that little girl was singing and the brother just said that's queer as fuck. So I have been asked to do this about, I don't know, I honestly could say maybe like 20 times, right? People just want to know what my settings are on here and that makes sense. I mean, a lot of people probably just got this for Christmas or they're just, you know, confused how to use it and I totally understand. I'm gonna do my best to share my settings just for people who want to get this info or for people who are wondering how to set it up correctly and in no way is this the correct way. This is just the way I found out to be the best and the way that people have told me to do it, I basically just leave off of other videos and it's the, basically the best way to do it so I'll leech off of this video if you need to please just drop a like that's all that's all I ask okay so we're in here right now and this is literally the fastest thing I've ever felt in my life like I move you can see this you can see this I move this like barely at all it's impossible right and uh, that's because my DPI is at the highest so you want to make sure your mouse sensitivity or your mouse DPI is at the highest it can possibly be at it's like for the best way to use the sim. You also want to make sure that your in-game sense is the highest as well. Let me double check if that's correct. And it is. Okay. DPI in-game sensitivity have to be at the max. Doesn't matter if you've got like a 30 million DPI mouse. You got to put it up on the max. It's the best thing to do. You'll just have to use a lower sensitivity. The sensitivity I'm giving you is probably not going to feel good for you. I am going to change it completely today because I've been playing PC like I said. And the scoping in there, it's a lot different because hip sensitivity is completely different from the aim down side sensitivity. And that's not how it was on here for me i would have my aim down sensitivity like super quick as well like the way it is right now this is just insanely like disgustingly fast like not a nobody in the world could even use this like let's, let me try to get a kill with this hold up if i move this mouse just a tiny bit i can barely even like i can't even tell you how hard it is okay well we're the best we're leaving we can do anything on any sensitivity. See, the issue and why I'm changing my sensitivity today with you guys is, like I said, after playing on the PC, I've realized that a scoped in sensitivity is a lot better when it's slower. It's kind of obvious, I guess, but mine was like, I just got past the point where it just was comfortable and I just had it so, so freaking fast that I could only snipe comfortably with it, right? I was able to snipe, I was able to quick scope, that's pretty much it. But if I slowed it down, I would have had a lot better accuracy, it would have been easier to control and everything. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna change my sensitivity. I'm gonna hop into bots really quick and we're gonna set up a custom game so we can have somebody to shoot at that won't piss us off. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up the Zim4 Manager. I'll show you guys right here on the second uh, webcam that I have. Just the best angle I can get for this probably. This is the thing that you need to be able to, you know, actually change your settings. And it's great because it's Bluetooth. And if you're looking at it and wondering why it's on AW, that's because I use Advanced Warfare on this game. And I'm not positive if that's the best or if that's the worst. Um, I'm pretty sure that it's good and it's better because I've used the World War II and I've used the AW one. And there's a guy that I found that's an actual good sniper and he uses AW and he backs it 100%. So I'm probably we're gonna stick with AW it feels good for me is no problem with it and that's kind of one thing I wanted to say is that if you have a certain game config that you want to use just because it's specifically for the game but you know the game config itself doesn't have all the stuff you want or you know like some people said that their shift buttons weren't working you can run a completely different config like you can do like a like a black ops 2 one you can do any one you want on here I could do freaking like arc survival if I wanted to like I said though it's really not the best idea to use these random configs I'm just telling you right now that the AW one works pretty well and it's very I've used it since the game came out and it works very well if you want to snipe with it if you want to use red gun with it, it works very well and I'm gonna set it up with you guys right now so pretty much here's my AW config right now now my hip is at 125.80 obviously my ADS is way too fucking quick so I'm gonna knock it down from 110 to like we're gonna knock it down to I'm gonna say like 7 I'm gonna say 60 actually we'll try 70 and there's a little save button up here that pops up and you want to hit that if you're actually done with your config you don't have to hit that so check this out if I have a config that I like it's at 70.80 right and let's say I want to change like 71.30 just out of curiosity, just to mess with it, see how it feels. If you don't hit the save button, it won't automatically save, which means if you don't forget to save it, you know, in a few minutes or later, it's not going to actually save. And so we're testing this out now, and this is still way too fucking quick, like way too fast. And that's because this mouse that I'm using, I'm, it, hits, it has a higher DPI than the mouse I was using previously. So we're going to knock this down from 70 down to like maybe 40. And that sounds insane to me. See, I usually end up having to rock like 100. It's still way too quick, by the way. This is still way too too quick which is just insane to even think about so ads we're gonna knock this down from 40 to 21 finally getting to the point where it's starting to feel a little bit more comfortable or more like how it did on pc at least turning around is a bitch with this thing though 
So I'm having a hard time with this. It feels like shit right now, and that's what happens with the fucking Zim sometimes. You, it feels like shit. What I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna save this all as it is, and I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna unplug the Zim and plug it back in. The reason I'm doing this is because um, the thing is sometimes it feels different. The sensitivities feel different, and you gotta kind of reset the Zim, and what I do is I just unplug it really quick, and it kind of just like, oh god. See, look at this. What is this? Way, way too high still. We're knocking this down to a good fucking like 50 maybe. 65 just doesn't make any sense to me, right? Okay, well, we can hit shots. And this is gonna take me a while to use to like for real because yeah see I, I the quick scoping is completely different right it's a lot slower in the ads so that when i'm scoping in like this and i'm trying to you know drag to this guy right here it's gonna take a lot more effort and drag to actually drag to the left if i'm gonna kill him as it would when i'm using like a really fast ads so it's gonna take me a little bit of adjustment time see that's the thing there's no set number of you know ads and hip sensitivity that you want to use you want to just trial and error i suggest starting i mean it really is just like starting and messing with it that's all it is you want to make sure that your ads is comfortable with not only your sniper but your pistol too and whatever other guns are using of course and so that's pretty much that anything else we can look at really quick before we go into a game there is um you know like this keyboard the wsd these are all usually default the buttons these are all gonna be to whatever you want them to be this is what i use like i've said this is what i use on my zim 4 i will always use that for the zim 4 it's nice and compact doesn't take up too much room and then this is the mouse i use it is the logitech g303 daedalus apex prime or daedalus prime i think it's the g303 though you guys get the gist of it we're gonna mess with this and we're gonna go online and we're gonna try to hit a clip of the sensitivity jesus fuck it's just it just takes a minute guys it takes a little bit of freaking Oh my fucking god, dude! Ooh. I mean, you know, if I didn't miss that, it would've been kinda sick. We're getting there, right? You can tell that- you can tell that we're getting the sensitivity out, okay? You wanna not- you wanna actually not do that? You could- I'm sure you have anything else on this planet to do other than get in my fucking face. Like, seriously. Oh, dude, where was the swap at? Where was the swap at? I had the perfect sw If they just would have spawned there, I would have hit a fucking banger. Oh, we got one, two... Three. A little four piece kill cam action right there. You know what I'm saying? I picked up a swap and I had a perfect opportunity to like a, a quad feed out of the whole thing or something. Alright, well, I hope that video was somewhat informative at all for you guys. Um, I've never really done a video like that, so I know it probably would, you know, could have been organized a little bit better. It could have been done a little better if I thought about it. Maybe I'll make another one in the future, but as of now, uh, the final results on what my sensitivity settings were, uh, from what I started just to play throughout was 30.30 .30 on the hip, and for the ADS, it was 9.80. Like I said, I could change that and still hit shots and still hit clips. It's just preference and it's how you feel comfortably. It takes a while to get used to that, and it is different than PC, but it is also similar to PC. Personally, I enjoy the Zim. I'll use it from time to time. I would rather use my Scuff and play Claw, but my Scuff, both of my PS4 controllers are broken, and I'm not playing a regular PS4 controller with the uh, concave thumbsticks. I just don't. I can't use that at all. I have to use the domed. I'll probably get a new Scuff eventually, but for now, I'm just going to be using the Zim when I play on the PS4, but I'm also going to be making a lot more World War II PC videos since I can kind of run it now. If I helped you at all in this video, or you found it informative or you just enjoyed it please drop a like though it means a lot um subscribe if you're new daily uploads on this channel so if you don't want to miss them subscribe and hit the notification button but yeah it's been ritz and i will see you guys on tomorrow's video peace